Hey, so what is GM Blazable from GamerFusion.com, guys, and today I want to show you something really, really cool that I got. Yes, guys, I officially got the Dragon's Breath. Woo 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 woo! Been wanting the Dragon's Breath since the DLC came out, and I, we, I was able to get it today on the raid. So let's get a quick overview now. Just a quick note and reference point. This is not a review of the Dragon's Breath. This is just an overview of the Dragon's Breath. I believe when you make weapon reviews, you should definitely not do them unless you're, you know, unless the rocket is fully upgraded. So just a quick note. This is the no review. So first and foremost, it says burn the world, burn it all. So it's a rocket launcher, exotic rocket launcher. You're able to obtain it from different various points. You can obtain it from the. Uh, Raid from the Nightfall and uh, from the Crucible, basically anywhere you could get an exotic, you could probably get it from that part. So this is a solar damage weapon, guys. The rate of fire is uh, relatively low. Blast radius is very, very high, which makes it a very useful weapon for crowd control. We got velocity, stability, very, very well, and velocity a little bit low, reload speed, and magazine size 2-2. Uh, material you're going to need to upgrade this is spin metal and one exotic shard. Like I said, this is solar damage, and uh, we have smart drift control, so that's going to give you a uh, predictable and controllable recoil penalty to velocity. And you see this one, we get an increment of uh, more uh, more blast radius, more velocity, but less stability. And then we have another one with more velocity, uh, with more velocity, but you lose stability. Um, I'll definitely go over which is the best setup you should have when using this one on my review. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Then we have tripod. This launcher tube can hold three shelves, so instead of holding uh, two mags, you are able to hold three rocket launchers. Then we have upgrade damage. Then we have this weapon can be drawn believably fast. It increases the warhead velocity. Increases the warhead blast radius. And then we have a Pyromancer. It has rounds fired from this weapon, leaves a solar flare upon detonation. So this is really cool because uh, once it detonates, it leaves a solar flare. Really, really cool. Then we have upgrade damage, upgrade damage, upgrade damage, upgrade damage. So overall, this does look like a very sexy weapon. I've always called it the Shark's Breath instead of the Dragon's Breath. But uh, I know you guys have been requesting for me to do some, um, some tests test fires you know when I do these overview videos so let me go ahead and do that one thing I would like to note is that when you guys point that right there I would have liked to have it so you could actually see the uh, you know the teeth a little bit better here on the dragon's Hopefully breath but apparently you can't even if I that. try to nice. zoom it sideways it's still right unable to see it the except the for when it sways you'll see right now when it sways it'll oh, automatically show its teeth real quick <laughs> come on sway sway <laughs> I wasn't gonna stay up till in the now, even when I move, it doesn't sway. All right, so regardless of that, I'm we're gonna go see um, how it shoots. One thing I did notice is when you're running with it, yeah, it does cover I'm your whole out. right side, so yeah. that leaves your uh, your right side well, fully vulnerable awesome. to what happens. So here it goes, guys. Here's a shot of the view. Uh, Dragon's Breath that you see right there, it shoots people off, so once it's fully upgraded, it's probably be a nice wrecking machine. It does clear enemies a lot, a lot quicker, so definitely something worth me watching. Well guys, I hope this video was helpful and informative. Let me know what you guys think of the Dragon Breath, if you guys have it already. If you don't, let me know in the comment section down below. And don't forget, for all things Destiny, head over to Gamer Fusion, where we empower your gaming.